hey guys welcome back to my channel so i am going to be starting off by just packing um my p louise base in the shade Ruma number two this base is a must get you guys um because it actually prepares um for your eyeshadow and i love the way it actually sits after some time you've packed it so you want to make sure that you're actually packing this so that you actually eliminate any creases that may come along the way so i'm going to be using my beauty sponge as you guys can see so that i eliminate my creases so i'm going to be going in with my be perfect cosmetics carnival um xl pro palette i'm going to be going in with the shade in last first and I'm going to be packing this on my eye using um, Murphy brush M12. I love this brush because um, you actually, it actually allows you to actually pack the eyeshadow where you want it to be without even blending it first. So I'm just going to be packing this on my eyelids as you guys can see. And I'm making sure that I don't press the brush too hard. And I'm going to be going in with the shade Funky from the Be Perfect Cosmetic um, Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm going to be using the, M, the M506 brush. I tell you guys, this brush has changed my blending game. My blending game is not the same anymore. I am so happy about this purchase. I am really excited about this purchase and I did want to do a review on these brushes but my video got messed up at the end. So I'm going to be going in with the shade um, Pep, Pep Talk from the Stacey Maria um, Be Perfect actually um, palette and I'm going to be just packing this um, shade as my transition color. As you guys can see I'm just tapping the shade i'm not um i'm not like blending it um anyhow so i'm gonna be just packing this or tapping this on my eye as my transition color as you guys can see So I realized that the pink I used first was not dark enough um, so I went in with the shade Reckless on the Be Perfect Cosmetic Eyeshadow Palette. This is my absolute favorite eyeshadow palette. I don't see myself going into another palette anytime soon but we move but we have to re to review other palettes but this one is definitely my favorite eyeshadow palette so i'm going to be going in with the p louise base in the shade number 05 and i'm going to be packing this on my cut crease as you guys can see and i'm going to be using the murphy brush in um m166 and i'm just going to be tapping that so that i can remove any um creases along the way because my eyes are very um hooded which means that there is more um there are more um creases on my eyes and one thing i realized about my eyes is that um when i'm cutting the crease the crease is really straight and it's really popping um but when now i'm done uh, it feels like it's skewed somehow um it feels like it loses its shape i'm not sure why but i think it's because of my eyes so i need to learn my eyes more so now i'm going in with the sh with the brush um from Muffy. it's the m456 brush and now as you guys can see i'm just going in with the shade um funky 
I think it's the second shade I used so I'm going in with Funky just to blend out my cut crease and I'm gonna be going in with this um, shimmer shade which is Orchard I think so I'm gonna be packing this um, on my eyelid and I'm gonna be using the Muffy um, what brush is this um, I think it's the M M152 and I'm gonna be packing this on my I'm gonna be using this brush to pack the shade on my cut crease and i'm gonna be going in with um a pep talk the brightest pink you see guys and i'm gonna be just blending out um that shade with my shimmer shade i used so i'm not sure whether you guys enjoy watching um voiceover videos or you guys want me to um just talk throughout the video uh, i'm not sure so please do comment down below and let me know so that i know what you guys want me to do so i'm gonna be going in with my lash me princess i believe from essence this is the mascara i've been using this mascara and i love it and i'm gonna be taking my revlon color stay foundation and i'm gonna be packing this um, on my eye and I did prime my eyes by the way you guys and I'm going to be taking the shade cafe from the candid um, collection concealer and I'm going to be using this as my highlight so I'm just going to be um, blending out obviously with my beauty sponge and I realized that the brush technique is really the best so I use the brush to actually blend out my concealer and I'm going to be using the L'Oreal um, infallible concealer in the shade coffee and I'm gonna be using this as my contour. So yeah, as you guys can see, I'm using my brush and everything is just so fast. <laughs> I used my Muffy E62 brush to contour my nose and now I'm going in with my Such A Buttercup setting powder to set my whole entire highlights. So I'm gonna be going in with the NYX Can Stop Home Stop um, foundation powder foundation and i'm gonna be using this as my contour powder and also i used the muffy m506 to um actually get that snatched nose I feel like the lighting was too harsh on my face but i assure you that um i wasn't that pale <laughs> so yeah and now i'm going in with my ttdi lashes in d784 i love these lashes like they're so dramatic but not that dramatic they are really not giving me those uh type of lashes that we are wearing now so yeah So I went in with my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray and now I'm going in with my MAC Trio Highlights or something like that to highlight my face and I love highlighting my forehead and my chin so that it, my chin can actually look a bit slim. <laughs> so now I'm going in with my Beauty Blender to blend out my highlights so that it won't be harsh, it will look like my skin or it will look like it's coming through my skin So now I am going to line my lips and I'm using the intuition shade from the Be Perfect Cosmetic um, eyeshadow palette and I'm going to be using this to line my lips and 
after that i'm gonna use my nyx i think this is um the soft matte lip cream uh, in the shade um, Stockholm, I don't know, I don't know how to pronounce this name yet, but I'm gonna be going in with that shade. I love this color. I'm actually getting through this um, color lipstick, so I, I really need to change my game. So, yeah, this is it, you guys. I hope you did enjoy this video. This is the finished look. I hope you did enjoy this video. Thank you so much for always supporting me. Thank you so much for all, for all the love that you guys show me. If you did enjoy this video, please do give it a big thumbs up. I love you guys for watching. I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.